Hello and welcome back. In this video, we are going to learn how to detect cars in a traffic video. So let's go into the MATLAB help section and go to image processing toolbox, look at the examples and go down to detecting cars in a video of traffic. And let us open this example. So let us, uh, just like the previous time, run this code line by line and then see what happens. And let's understand it step by step. Okay, so this is an input video which is being read by the video reader and it is being stored in traffic object. And as we are not uh, using the semicolon here, it gives the summary of uh, the reader object. And then get traffic object would uh, give you some details about the traffic object such as uh, uh, all these things as you can see and then you can play this video using I am play let us try to do that okay I okay so I'm not sure if you can see this okay so you can play the video using I am play so yeah Uh, next, this is the processing part. We are taking the value of dark car as 50. Uh, and in this video, we are only going to detect white cars and not dark cars. Okay. So, uh, we are doing dark car equal to RGB to gray of this particular frame of the image. So, we are taking one particular frame and then storing it in dark car. And... Uh, Removing the dark cars is done by using this function, which is I am extended max of dark car comma dark car value. So the dark uh, to learn more about this function, what we have to do is doc space I am oops I'm sorry I am extended mass uh, extended max. So what this function does is it gives the extended maximum maxima of an image, and what the extended maxima means is that if you have a pixel value greater than 80 in this image, it would take the surrounding uh, its surrounding values also until it gets a sharp edge and all of that is considered. So uh, enough of talking, let us see the image. So yeah, this is how it works. So this is with uh, uh, with the dark car also in the image and you can see that only white cars are detected properly and dark cars are not detected Next we are going to use a structural element of two pixels and then we are going to use I am open I am open is used to remove small structures in the image So as you can see you will have this only at uh, you will have these spots only for white cars and not for dark cars and then we are going to apply the same on the whole on the whole video so we are going to f get the number of frames and then uh, for uh, k equal to 1 to number of frames we apply this image processing algorithm so inside this we are reading a frame and then we are converting it to gray doing the same operation of I am extended max to remove dark cars and then using I am open to remove the uh, remove the lane markings and non disk shaped structures and then you remove small structures by using BW area open this would remove all the small structures less than 150 pixels and then uh, yeah so you're gonna what you're gonna do here is that you, uh, so you have this final processed image right you take that image and you extract the properties of centroid and area of uh, all the pixels of the of all the cars of all the structures in your image you extract its centroid and area and then uh, the area is stored here and uh, what you're doing here is pretty much just trying to put a dot so uh, you're trying to put uh, put a dot on the car so you're just extracting its centroid uh, so you're running this 
and you're extracting its centroid and then with a width of 2 you're uh, you're marking a dot there so for all these pixel values from c of 1 minus width to c of 1 plus width you're making the pixel value to 0 255 uh, 25500 which is a red dot so let us uh, run the whole image and see the output so this is the output video I hope you can see this and as the white car comes you see uh, you see the dots I ho I'm not sure if you can see this in the video but you will be able to see this on your computer uh, I hope you like the video thanks for watching